consensus wide receiver five, Tyreek Hill. Uh, Tyreek Hill was wide receiver two overall last season, had more than 1,700 yards and eight total touchdowns, one coming on the ground. The Miami Dolphins playoff schedule is home against the New York J-E-T-S, Jets, Jets, Jets. Home. Love that game. Home against Dallas. Yeah. Love that game as well. And then at Baltimore. Okay. To, to, to put a bow on it. Um, there's there's nothing to there's nothing bad at there least is. performance there. wise against Tyreek as far as skill on the field and what Fair. he did last season what he can do the one thing that's out there is that he's seemingly likely to face criminal charges after a Father's Day incident at a North Miami Beach marina. Uh, with the victim of an alleged assault intending to take legal action against Tyreek Hill, who is accused Uh of slapping a 57-year-old man during an argument that evidently Drew Rosenhaus and other people were present for, and they later went out on a yacht at the marina that same day. So... The all Miami has done is basically acknowledge the fact that there's allegations and there's like an unofficially official, you know, investigation taking place. The NFL has not announced anything in terms of suspension at this point, Um, which they can do under the personal conduct. Thousand percent conduct of the manual to the team. Um if they suspend him, it could it could sewer teams' championship hopes. Um, yeah, de- hope- definitely definitely something to pay attention to as we get closer to the season, right? Because I was gonna say there's there's two months between now and draft date. Like this has to be you you are praying that this is resolved prior to your draft. Yeah, uh, and then. You're you're sitting there at the turn, and Tyree Kill is suspended for four or six games, and you're like, you know what, f it, I'm taking Hill and Lamb, and uh, I'm just going to figure out my other wide receiver spot the first six weeks, and then you have you know two potential top five wide receivers when he comes back, um, and you just got to survive the suspension at that point, um, or or. You know, this drags into the season and then it's what happens if he gets suspended for like the last four games of the year, the last six games of the year, and then you have sewered your championship hopes. Yeah, potentially. I mean, uh, Kamara was was videoed beating some guy up at like the day before the Pro Bowl and he still hasn't been suspended. So this this stuff seems to take a while under the NFL's uh, that's uh, very, very va- vaunted commissioner. So uh, obviously something to pay attention to. Yeah. Tyree Kill's ADP is currently 7.3. Uh, Fantasy Pros has him at four. We have him at five. Third in targets last year with 170, second in catches with 119, second in yards with 17, 10, uh, seven touchdowns, which is tied for 12th, third in points per game, uh, half PPR, just under 17. And the Dolphins threw the 11th most passes. Uh, I, I, other than the uh, obvious uh, downside of him just kind of being a garbage human being, uh, the <laughs> from a from a fantasy perspective, the other concern too is uh, to uh, is to uh, is yeah can, can can he stay healthy? Because when when he got hurt last year, I mean they still did fine, but that's that's the concern. He's one concussion away from I mean potentially yeah. Tom Brady replacing him. I I guess, but like. I just don't know what happens if if Tua can't stay healthy. Yeah, I mean, you're not wrong. Uh, that was really scary what happened to Tua last year with, uh, you know, I don't even know what you want to call it, partial clearance, clearance, and then come yeah. back in and get another head injury Clear, right clearance, away. Clearance, clearance. Yeah, it, I, I, it was I, bad. I mean, 
Mike White, <laughs> the former New York Jet, is backing him up, and and we know that he's he's willing to throw the ball sixty times. And if that's the same, he supported Garrett Wilson just fine. <laughs> so I mean, th- there could be worse things that happen, I guess. But um, that that is one concern is the health of their quarterback. They have one of the better offensive minds in football, as as uh, McDaniel's being their coach. So. Garbage human being, great fantasy player, uh, something to pay attention to to see if he gets suspended.